Hello, I'm Joe Pin and welcome to Forever Skies, which has just had a huge update, the gardening update, which has obviously added gardening into the game. It's added some new areas to explore, but more importantly, it has also added the second story chapter, because when we played this back in the summer, there was only one story chapter, now there's two, so we can sort of advance the story of trying to find the cure for this pathogen. Uh, if you don't know what this game is, this is a survival game where we humanity has moved to space and we're living up there. We're sent back down to Earth, which is all destroyed, as you can see, by a sort of ecological disaster, which kind of spawned this virus, uh, which we've got to find a cure for. And we do that by navigating the uh, planet with this airship that we get to build out obviously at the start it is a very small little box that is it but you can build it out to be huge massive airships i think by the end of the game uh, last time i built quite a big airship and obviously there's gardening there's all the survival so you got to find food water the usual sorts of stuff as well a uh, really fun game i'll leave it linked in the description if you want to check it out for yourself and wishlist it all that good stuff uh, but let's just kind of jump in i'm going to start a new game i believe this was my old game yeah july last year wow yeah it's been a long time since i played this game uh, i believe you can just carry that game on if you want to but i'm going to start a new game um, so let's just kind of get into it there's a bunch of different settings but i'm just going to go with normal i think rather than hard uh, permadeath absolutely not so uh, yeah we'll just go normal i think Okay, so there we go, we have landed. Uh, we've been sent down also to look for another research team, I believe, that we've lost contact with. Uh, so let's read this uh, journal. Uh, so after months of silence, Sagittarius 2 sent us distress signal and fell silent again. This is our only chance. Uh, no one knows who await, uh, what awaits you there, but if there is a chance that they have found a cure, then maybe we can survive. Find the cure at all costs, the fate of uh, all of us depends upon you, the Ark. Um, so yeah, as I say, uh, humanity has kind of retreated to space in this arc. Kind of reminds me of, was it The 100, the TV show, where humanity had done the same thing? I think it was like a nuclear war or something in that, wasn't it? Uh, let's open this, and there we, we go. At the source of the signal. Let's go. Uh, the airship will be up there, but as I say, it is just a very small uh, little airship, but we can build it out eventually. Uh, there is debris floating around, so we'll be able to eventually harvest this stuff. I think there was like synthetics and metal floating about the place and you can eventually get auto harvesters as well Symptoms oh hello virus activity detected. Check your health regularly. yeah there we go it's just kind of tell me so there's my meters down in the bottom i've got my stamina i've also got my health food and water so let's just kind of make our way up here and yeah we've just got to find all this stuff i believe you can continue your uh, save game as well if you uh Want to just continue from where you left off? You can do that as well, uh, which is always a nice thing. I'm going to start again. Just loot everything up. It's just machine parts around here. Have uh, we got anything there? Get some water. Can of old water. That's great. Nope, can't open that locker. Uh, here we go. It's all gone to hell. Everything has been screwed up since we went down there. Our immunity is decreasing and we are getting sicker and running out of energy. Our equipment is malfunctioning. malfunctioning. And then there's uh, this NOAA situation. We should never have sent uh, this expedition. Our place is on the space station. The power blew out again and the door is locked. I'll check if the beacon tower has a compatible battery. Okay. Yeah, so it seems like one of the crew that was sent down is yeah, acting strangely, to say the least. Uh, so let's come over here. Yeah, obviously, that's one of the crew. And yeah, we've got the battery that we need for that. I don't think there was much else here. I thought there was fruit around here. Maybe not. Okay. Let's jump down. And if we put that in there, we should be able to open that door up. Yep, there we go. Undelivered message. Hello. Uh, we didn't get the cure, but we found out that 400 years ago, before the calamity, research was conducted and something was discovered. 
we came down under the dust and we're so close uh, that's when we all started to when it's the when it all started to go to hell uh, Noah went crazy and started hearing voices uh, that bastard stole all the data airship and broke our equipment he left us to die and fled his uh, to his hideout in a greenhouse tower he's dangerous as all hell uh, the communication ports are not working they are blocked by something from within uh, but we uh, can't determine what it is as if we if the world doesn't want us to uh, let us send the messages the virus is wreaking havoc on our bodies and we're getting weaker and weaker the conditions are greatly accelerated or accelerate its effects if anyone reads this beware the wor this world is not our home anymore we are not welcome okay fair enough all right let's go over here this door should now open yes it does let's loot everything that we can first aid kit and we'll take all the machine parts that we can and then, yeah this is obviously noah's room he's gone a little bit doolally to say the least there we go take that take the can of water uh, this one is noah's madness it's all because of this damn dust noah's head heard voices he was mumbling about uh, nature surviving everything, even the fall of the world. He said he knew what we could do so we could return to Earth again. He wants us to uh, help him to follow the voices in his lunatic, in his head lunatic. Uh, we, lock, we locked him in a cell for his own good, but the, the bastard hit the extractor and ran off with everything uh, while everyone was asleep. Okay, let's go with that. Right, let's go up here. Do we miss anything? Ah, hang on. There's a little machine part there. Let's take everything we can. There's the airship. But as I say, it's very simple at the moment. But you can expand it out, make one big airship, or you can put an extra um, uh, little, uh, what is these things, airship bit on it. Yeah, there we go. That's that's the word. Because uh, you have lift. So, uh, But we'll kind of get into all that later on. For now, we're just going to be driving around in a very small box. But that's okay. So, find a way to depart. Let's read this. Ah, there we go. We've been uh, building a new airship for two months since the bastard Noah got away with our equipment. Uh, if my uh, only my workshop hadn't collapsed, I would uh, have already had the airship uh, research completed. So, rudder, etc. Okay, so we've got to do all that sort of stuff. That's fine. There's the fabricator. That's what we're going to use. Kind of like Subnautica as well, this game, I would say. Let's put that there. And it wants us to craft a deck extractor. But I need some transformer for that, so I need to go searching for that. Um, but there we go, it's giving me a load of blueprints. I think that would be in here. Let's take the empty bottle. Let's take a bunch of this stuff. A lure, because we'll have to fish for food. Kind of get into all that in a minute. Read. We run out of food and water supplies. So yeah, this is the fishing lure that we can use to kind of dangle down, because yeah, there are moths living in the upper layer of dust. Uh, we just need to use the insect lore to attract them in and then we can capture them. Uh, but I think we have to cook them, yeah, so uh, that's all good. Let's come over here though before we set that up. And we'll just grab all of these machine parts. We're going to have to duck down. Grab an old can of water. Let's climb up here. And there we go. I feel like I missed something back there. So we're missing like a battery or uh, whatever it was to make the uh, industrial extractor or the extractor sorry not the industrial extractor just the extractor all right let's come back anyway can i make that no i need a transformer okay oh that was over here duh there we go <laughs> i just missed it right let's go and do that and then if we hold that we can then make a desk extractor put it out here and then we can shoot Printing these completed. Uh, balls that are flying around which have um, synthetics or metal uh, but you can also take apart some of this stuff as well uh, but let's go here just drop that like there and then I can stand on this extractor and then we can just extract that for instance like there there we go that gives me some glass gives me a bit of metal there we are and then if we take one of those that should give me metal as well I think those things give me synthetics yeah synthetics uh, basically we've got to cut our way into there so we can get into the workshop uh, so at some of the wrecks you'll be able to do that cut a hole in and then you'll be able to explore whatever it is so there we go let's take that let's take that as well Ah, the research station we'll take that in a minute 
Just kind of loot the rest of this stuff. Well, actually, we'll be able to take it. And then just there we go. Uh, oh, let's take the solid batteries because we're going to need those. As I remember, they were very important. Let's see what else? Yeah, so that's why we came in. But uh, yeah, right. Uh, blueprint research. I managed to repair the research station. Yeah, okay, that's good. We just need to power it up. So I've got to place the research station, but we don't really have a lot of space. But we'll do our best with it. I mean, we'll just have to kind of put it like there. And then if we power it up. And then we've got to research a scanner. There we go. And then I'm going to put the lure on there. Like so. And then if we lower it down. Research finally. There we are. So now build a scanner. I'm going to need some synthetics. Let's just kind of do this. And we'll just extract some of this stuff whilst we wait. That's good because we'll wait for the lure. We should just catch something. Uh, but I think we had to cook it. Oh, I think you could eat it, but it would you know, cause you some damage. But there we go. Now that's token. If we pull that back up, we should then have caught something. Oh, it caught like a cabbage, I think it was. Oh, a dust lettuce. Eat what's caught. I mean, all yeah, right, okay. I'll do what you says, but I don't really think that's a good idea, but we'll eat it. There we go. Ooh. It's also, we picked up this filter. Let's put that in there, and that should filter a little bit of water. That's good. Or extract it. I think we've got to make a... Uh, filter though, haven't we? Uh, craft the scanner anyway. Get ahead of myself. Let's do that. Craft the scanner, and then we can scan the various blueprints. So like Subnautica, uh, you could you know you can scan the various uh, bits. There we go. Oh yeah, no, I don't want to look at that. There we are. Scan you. Just scan a bunch of this stuff. It tells you what you can do with it. Uh, but as I say, we can scan uh, different uh, blueprints menus and stuff like that. So we can find uh, various new things that we can build. Research stations or crafting stations or bits and bobs for the ship, etc. as well. So that would be cool. Uh, check the studies menu. Okay. Check that. Yeah. Ah, I've got a scan... I've got to scan some float. Oh, ooh, there's some. There we go. Research engine and fuel. Right, so let's do that then. Uh, we've got to research the engine and the fuel. There we go. That's good. And I think whilst that's going, I'm just going to take some part of some of this, I think. Research finally. Okay, I've just been harvesting a few materials. I think the engine is ready. Yep, there we go. So I'm just going to put this on. It's just going to look a bit dirty and rubbish at the moment, but uh, you know, we we just got to do what we got to do to be able to move. So I'm just going to stick it Maximum here for now. So we've got 15 kilometers. We could put more on and then upgrade it so you can go faster. You also get uh, engines that do lift as well. Um, we've now got to craft some synthetic fuel. Let's do that. And I'm just going to keep on harvesting a few things that blow past. Oh, there we go. All right, well, let's get that. And then we'll get moving, I think. Let's open the fuel tanks. Drop that in there, and then we depart the location. I, think we, I don't think I've missed anything. I'll just have a quick run around, but I don't think I've missed anything. There wasn't much here. Yeah, we built the airship. We've got to depart the location, and we've got to go for uh, one of these signals with the flashing light. So you can see over there, there's a flashing light. Uh, there's a few others. It's kind of indicating as places that you can uh, go and loot. Uh, so we'll go and do that. Let's take off, shall we? So a bit cramped in here, but that's just the way it's going to be for the moment. Let's go up that way. And we go forwards. Uh, but we're only going to move very, very slowly at the moment. Mission started. There we Find go. A cure for the virus. Send it to the space station. Save humanity. 
there we are. So we're going to go to the first light source. And you can just stop at wherever you want. And you could just start fishing, for instance. Or, uh, you know, you can just stop wherever you can. Also, couldn't you? Hang on. Let's just get off this. Might be out of range, but I'm sure you could harvest. Yeah, it's out of range. You could harvest the building. And uh, sometimes they collapsed and that sort of thing as well. You can get metal. But um, let's not worry about that for now. Let's just kind of make our way here. But... Uh, I'll bring you guys along for the first one, but um, I'll probably cut some of the travel out because there's not really much other than me just travelling from A to B. Uh, but for the first one, I'll, br I'll bring you guys along. But, um, yeah, really, really cool game. I really enjoyed this when I played it uh, in the summer, and hopefully it's had a lot of improvements since then. Although it was a, I'd say it was a solid game anyway. Uh, oh, those are the moths, I think. Is that the moths? Unknown location reached. Yeah, there we go. Come down here. And we'll kind of park up here somewhere. Let's kind of do that. There we go. Lower it down so we kind of landed on the ground. There we go. Oh, hello. Am I okay? Yeah, I think I'm okay. Uh, can we make like a cooker or something? Electric cooker. Let's make one of those. I know I'm going to need it. I need that to cook up food, etc. Oh, there we go. Preliminary analysis <coughs> so, communication points. So, the various points. Yeah. Okay. Alright, well, she interrupted me. I was about to say, if you go to these places, they'll have things to scan. Completed. Like this, for instance. So, that will give us lift. I believe, yeah. Wrecked basic turbine. Increase the flight altitude of the ship. There we are. That's cool. Yeah, yeah. That's great. And then we'll grab some of these electrical things. Transformer, we're going to need that as well. Let's keep the scanner out because we might find some more things to scan. Yeah, we've already scanned that. Have we scanned that? Oh, no. Oh, we'll scan it anyway. Why not? Ah, ah, scrap plastic. That was definitely something that we needed. Can I scan that? No. Okay. But that was definitely useful, as I remember. Check these trash piles because, yeah. That's where they were hanging out, and that was a useful thing. I think you could uh, craft it. Event you could craft it though, but obviously you can find it. It's a lot easier. Let's go up there, and then we've got to go. We've got to research the airship builder, and we've got to find a location with the double flashing lights. Okay, let's take the battery out of that one. Uh, oh, hello. You got something to search? What is that? Tool, flashlight. Oh, right, okay. Uh, I don't think I want that because there's a water purifier unless we can't make that yet. Uh, we might not be able to make that. Not too sure. But let's come down this way. Uh, there were storms and lightning storms and things that would strike the airship as well. Uh, hang on, can I get off? Oh, there we go. That's a little bit sticky. Uh, oh, more plastic. That's definitely something we want. There we go, and then we'll kind of just climb down there. You never know what's down here, so we do want to search the whole thing. Especially at the start, we're, you know, low on resources, so every little helps. Aha, can we get in here? Yes, we can. Brilliant. Oh, plastic again. Let's grab the plastic. Uh, we want, like, a rain collector as well, because we're getting a storm coming in, I think. And, uh, yeah, the rain catcher was a really good thing, but... Uh, we don't have that yet, so, you know. But that that was a useful thing. Uh, I'll take the electrical elements. Synthetic fuel. Oh, we'll take that. Hello. Repair piece as well, so we can repair our ship. So it will take damage. As I say, there'll be lightning storms and things. It'll happen, and we need to kind of take shelter. Search that. Oh, stop war poster. Yeah, we'll have that as well. We can hang that up in our airship. We'll take the repair patch. Don't think there's anything else here. I feel like I'm missing something, but uh, we could maneuver the airship and harvest some of this stuff as well, I guess. We could do that. Don't think there's anything else. I think that's it. As far as I could tell. Yeah, I think that's it. Is there anything down there? No. 
that's it. Okay, right. Let's go back at the top. And we'll make the airship builder. We could probably do with building out the airship a little bit. To be honest, because it's a little bit crowded in here, isn't it? Electrical cooker. We'll place that down. Let's make the... Uh, where is that? Tools? Oh, I've got to research, I think. Yeah, yeah, I've got to research it. Duh. So, basic airship builder. Ah, I need some synthetics. Oh, there's some right there. Let's take that. don't think I'm going to harvest that. No. Alright, that's fine, though. Let's take that, and then we can at least research this thing. It's good. And then I guess I'll just try and grab some... Yeah, synthetics. It's definitely something Research that we're going to need. Grab those. Grab those as well. We're going to need some to make uh, make this thing anyway, so we might as well grab it now. There we go. Nice. Right, so we've got that. Our water purifier, that's the one we want. But let's make this airship builder first. And then we'll make that water purifier because we can then start purifying the water. Because we've captured, uh, we use that filter and we captured a load of water from the sort of atmosphere. But we can't drink it. Well, we can. I mean, it's dirty, but you know, but we could bottle it. And I'm pretty sure we can make bottles in there as well. Let's grab some more synthetics. There we are. Let's grab some more synthetics because we're getting a little bit low on water. But we have got some cans of water, so. I think we'll probably just drink those for the moment. Yeah, that gives us 30 water back. And we'll eat a food ration as well. We'll dig into some of our rations. There we go. So we can now build. So we've got rooms. We've got a catwalks. We've got rooms with ladders, etc. So build a new room on the airship. So if we go to the build menu. Room. And that obviously adds weight to the ship as well. But let's just build that that's fine and then I think you could pick could you pick that up pick up there we go yeah and then you could just move it around that's fine uh, obviously we can fall out of this thing so uh, we'd want to put doors and stone walls and stuff on it but yeah again right now we are nowhere near ready for that so and we need synthetics. What I'm going to do is I think I'm going to start making my way to another flashing light over there. Let's start doing that. Uh, which one's up? That's up. Oh. Why can I not move? Oh, have I exceeded the max weight? I might have exceeded the max weight. Yeah, I feel like I have. Oh, build a wall on an airship. Oh, really? Build a new wall on the airship. Okay, maybe not. Maybe i got to do that first. Alright, well, let's grab some synthetics when they come by. Yeah, there we go. Let's just get moving again, because, um, yeah, I've exceeded the max limit, so I need to put another engine on this thing. Oh, look. Yeah, it's all the moths. Uh-huh. Okay, cool. Uh, but, yeah, I've kind of exceeded that max limit, so... Uh, I think what I'm going to do is just make my way over there. Ooh, can we take that one? Yeah, there we go. Oh, and then, yeah, and it collapses the building. <laughs> yeah, that's kind of cool. Uh, but yeah, we, we've got like a max, so we'd have to build like another sh engine, I think. Uh, which is something we'll do in a minute, but uh, right now, I'm not too worried about that. Uh, we'll just make our way to the next location, which is over there. And I will just keep on uh, harvesting. Okay, here we are. We're just coming up to the next location. Uh, let's kind of come over here. And then, yeah, I'll say we'll build the... Uh, oh. Do not want to go any further than that? Is that? Yeah, I think we can get out there, can't we? No, we want to go down a bit lower, I think. Yeah, just in case we can't get back up. Uh, there we go. It wants me to go to the double flashing, which is the one over there. But I think we stop here. Oh, hang on. Can I get up there? Climb aboard. Yeah, there we go. I can. Oof. That was close. <laughs> I thought I'd screwed up there for a second. 
Let's just get us down a little bit lower, shall we? Oh, I don't think we can get any further because, yeah, our front's probably hitting that. That's fine, though. We can climb on. We'll be okay. Not worried about that then for a second. Let's just check all around. Get away up here. Let's go up here because there will be some batteries. That's something we're definitely going to want. Uh, there is a day-night cycle as well, if I remember rightly. So let's take that. Uh, there might not be anything to scan here. It hasn't said anything about scanning, so. Uh, oh, it's that. Yeah, we've already done that, though, haven't we? Yeah, we've already got the flashlight. I think it's different types of locations have different ones, if I remember rightly. But let's just come over here. Make our way down there. Oh, with some stairs. Well, that's even better. Let's grab all of this. I'll keep this out. Just so we, in case we find something we could scan. There's probably a little bit more plastic somewhere, but I'm not seeing it. Ah, uh, yeah, we might need to use a deck extractor to get in here. Oh no, there's a door around the other side. That works too. Let's drop this thing, shall we? Okay, let's see. More scrap plastic, more scrap plastic. Oh, I'm going to have to jump. All right. Okay, all right. Well, I don't really want to do that, but I want to go in there and look at it and loot. So let's get in there, though. Let's grab this. Yeah, I remember now. You had to do some pretty hairy jumps, didn't you? Yeah. Okay. There we go. And we're in. So I don't think you could take the walls off and climb in any other way. Let's take that. Let's take the repair patch. Let's grab all of this stuff. It's going to be useful, especially early game anyway. Ah, data card. Glass railing. Yeah, that was it. You found blueprints as well uh, to various new things. So even though there might not be anything to scan, there might be like a, a blueprint card to find. Uh, so you get like railings and stuff like that that you can add to your uh, airship. Uh, oh. Yeah, we'll sort that out in a minute. Don't worry. We got pretty well. Oh, bit of scrap plastic. Might be a little bit more scrap plastic, but I think we're okay. Jump back. There we go. That's good. Yeah, a little more scrap plastic there. It's all good. Uh, let's go back. I think we're okay there. Yep. Yeah. Oh, did we check this? I don't think we checked. Yeah, we didn't check that for scrap plastic. That's definitely something we want. Keep on grabbing that. And then, yeah. Oh. Oh, is this a place below us? Looks that way, doesn't it? All right, let's drop in there. I don't know if that was a good idea, but... Oh, hello, I'm stuck. All right, well... I may have just broken it. Can I kind of climb down? Uh, let's open that up. I don't know how I get out, though. <laughs> I may have just messed up here. Kind of got stuck. Can I climb out? Uh, okay. Oopsie. Yep, I shouldn't have done that. Damn it. Hopefully there's an auto save because... Uh, Okay, so I just used unstuck. If you just hit escape, go there and unstuck. It'll just teleport you back to a safe place. So I managed to get out of there. And I've just come up and built a second engine because we're going to need that. So let's make some more synthetic fuel as well. And then we'll do this thing and actually make a room for the back of here. Like so. And then build menu. Oh, no, hang on. I don't want to do that. Build menu, we want to do walls. Uh, we could do plastic. Yeah, because we don't want a door yet. Let's do that, but we do want a door eventually. Let's cancel that. I may have to take that bit off the back. Do you know I'm going to do that now. Let's pick this thing up. We'll move that, and then I'm going to go removal, and we'll take that off there. And then 
think we'll exit that. We'll go for another plastic wall, just so I don't fall out the back there. There we are. That's good. A little bit, you know, a little bit dingy at the moment, but that's what we got. So, uh, where are we? Let's put down the cooker. Let's put down... Where are we? Stop war. There we go. Let's put down our poster as well. That's good. And so I just made some more... Where are we? I just made some more synthetic fuel. Let's make a bit more. Because we're going to need it. And that should... Printing completed. That should give me everything I need. Oh, did I research the basic turbine? No, I didn't. There we go. Let's research that as well. So I should now be able to move, right? Yeah, there we go. Research finalized. There we go. It was just that it was uh, too heavy, so I uh, couldn't go any further with it, but that's cool. Uh, let's make our way to this double location, like so. Uh, shift to go up and um, control to go down. Let's get out of there, and then whilst we're flying, uh, we will then look at making this turbine. So I need some metals. I've got some machine parts, I just need some metals now. Which is fine. Making our way over there. Uh, we're probably going to need... Actually, we're probably going to need... Yeah, we're probably going to need the metals. Because we... I think we need the lift to get higher up. Yeah, I think so. Of course, I can only see synthetics about at the moment. Uh, we could just go over there, though, and grab some metal, couldn't we? Collapse another building. That would work as well. Not the ideal strategy, but yeah. So I've just got to wait. Well, I might as well grab some of this stuff. Wait for some of this stuff to come in. A bit like raft as well, isn't it? You know, where all the rubbish is floating by. Okay, so I just came back to this platform that we were just on because I wanted to make the turbine because it's just going to be easier to place it rather than when we're out in the, uh, you know, the wilderness, as it were. So we'll just put that on there. And we've now increased our altitude, so I think we needed that, if I remember rightly, uh, to get to that flashing light over there. Because um, you can't go high enough, but that has increased us a little bit higher, so that should help us out now. Um, I think we probably need some... Have I got any bottles? No, do you know what I need? I need this... Uh, where is it? Cooking station. Where was the thing about There. I need that. I need that water purifier so we can then purify the water. We've got five bottles, uh, but I need... Uh, let's bottle that water up, and then we'll put that in there. And then we should then be able to drop those bottles in there, that water purifier, and then it'll purify the water for us. So we're all good to go. Yeah, I think we'll be okay with that. Let's put that on the wall, like there. And then we'll add the dirty water to it, and then it's purifying it. That's good. And then we could make some extra bottles as well. Um, I think we could. Can we make bottles? I'm sure, you could. But you could make bottles. Can you not make bottles? Maybe you can't make bottles. I thought you could. Or do we have to research them? Might be in the research thing. Oh yeah, empty bottle. Let's research that because that's going to be pretty handy, isn't it? An empty bottle. Uh, there we go. Uh, but I think for now, I think this is probably a good place to call it. And I think we'll end the episode. I'll just show you uh, this. So we should now be able to go up much higher, up to 250, I think it said. So we'll be able to get way above the dust cloud and the dust layer. And it gets kind of nice and beautiful and bright up here, doesn't it? All nice. Um, but yeah, we can then get that. And we should go a little bit faster because of the of the extra engines there there we go we're now doing 20 doing 30 kilometers uh, that's great uh, take the clean water let's do that as well there we go and now we've got five bottles of clean water and then you could sit here as I say and you can harvest things do some fishing over the side all that sort of stuff Really cool game. Absolutely brilliant. I love this game. Uh, but as I say, I think for now, I think that's where I'm going to call it and I'm going to end the episode. So if you like the one, please give me a thumbs up, comment your thoughts, stay on below, subscribe for more. I really do appreciate it. Stay safe out there, everyone, and I'll catch you next time.